So I'm editing the video and realized that I forgot to do an intro. So what is up you guys? It's your girl Noelle Alize. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on your post notifications so you get notified every time I post a new video. And smash that like button. I don't know if you guys seen my Snapchat. If you if you don't watch my Snapchat story, go and add me on Snapchat right now. The link is going to be or my Snapchat name is going to be down, down below. So I um, posted a video of my smoky eye that I had did yesterday and a couple of people wanted to see how I did that. But because I don't just want it to be a makeup look video again, I am going to do the smoky eyes and then I'm going to do like um, a skull in the bottom half of my face just because Halloween is coming up. And if you guys need inspirations then you guys could take this as an inspiration and follow along with this tutorial. So I'm going to try to look for a picture of kind of what I want to do. Alright, we're just going to move the camera. Alright guys, so I kind of moved the camera away from that mirror. I'm actually just going to go ahead and insert the picture that I kind of want to do. But I don't know how good my makeup skills are, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that one. Also, one of the smoky eyes is this one, and I actually recreated this one yesterday, or similar to this yesterday. So we're going to do this one right here. So my eyebrows are pretty much done. I did them earlier, and they look mediocre, so I'm just going to leave them like this. So we're just going to go ahead and go straight into the smoky eyes. And yeah, let's go. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take some tape below i don't know what this is called like the inner the outer corner of your eye just so that when we blend the bottom lash line to the top it connects without it looking like blended and then a harsh line if that makes sense it's so i'm gonna go in with this waterproof um this waterproof remel eyeliner pencil thingamajur and i'm gonna go ahead and just Kind of shape out where my crease is but i'm gonna go a little bit below my crease just because we're still gonna blend in the black into the crease and then the brown over the crease so we don't want it too high up so we're using this black uh liner before just because if you just go in with a black shadow it does, when you go to blend it out, it does tend to lose its pigment. So with this underneath, we're just going to pack it on top. It doesn't have to be perfect. But you don't want to go, like I said, too high into the crease because we're going to blend the black up and then the brown on top. And we don't want it to touch the bottom of our, our brows. You can just go ahead and take this down here. And then it kind of looks crazy right now, but it's okay. Like I said, you look crazy right now, but it'll all come together in the end. Just trust the... F oh, there's something in my eye. Trust the process. So... For now, we're done with the eyeliner. We're done with it. Don't mind the mess back here, you guys. So we're going to go into our James Charles habits. And I'm sure you guys seen this in my last video. It looks beat up. We're going to go into the spooky shade, which is the black shade in the palette. Uh, I don't know. This is a wet and wild brush. I'm pretty sure it's called like a flat brush or something. Any type of flat brush you have just to pack on the color. And right now, you don't have to worry about blending again. Just go ahead and pack the black on top of the liner just to set it and make it just a little bit more black. So 
what I'm gonna do to blend the black is first I'm gonna go ahead and just use a clean brush and try to smear that harsh line that we have right here we don't want to add any more black until this line is kind of like not as harsh what you're done mm -hmm. you're done yeah. i look crazy in the video? yeah did i cover my braids yeah Hold on. <laughs> my brother's here y'all okay go a little yeah right there my mom did my mom did those braids your hair could look nice too all right get out so i'm gonna go in with this brush no beans and 10 percent off in the jan charles palette and i'm just gonna pack this with this brush um right con like right on the black that we just blended on so it's gonna look like that and then we're gonna take this fluffy brush also from wet and wild most of these brushes are from wet and wild and just go ahead and blend and you want to just blend in place you don't really want to blend too high you could kind of see the shadow the brown shadow building up lightly onto going upwards so uh, so you just blend it and blend it until you're satisfied i'm gonna go into the cold dreams and i'm gonna go into 518 in the james charles palette with this shade i'm gonna go like right above it just to give it a little more of a lighter color honestly the key to a smoky eye is blending i can tell you all these techniques techniques i can tell you all these techniques on how i think you should do it but it's just whatever works for you and however your preference is okay so now we're gonna go ahead and take these tapes ouch ouch off sorry guys i know i might look crazy right now but i did like this up on foundation i'm gonna go ahead and use mostly well majority Krylon products so we're gonna first go in with the ultra under base Krylon. it's like a primer this is only gonna go wherever i didn't put the foundation these are from Krylon too this one actually the name came off of it but i'm pretty sure it's like a foundation type of thing So now that my the bottom is my the bottom of my face is covered. Wait, do I look so good compared to hers? <laughs>
This was as the best I can do. I might go put my uh, blue contacts in.
Alright you guys, so I'm really sorry that it that I didn't really talk through the bottom part. It was my first time doing the bottom part of my face, so it was a little hard. I did struggle a little bit. I was just looking at a picture, so I just went off the picture. And my Halloween makeup skills aren't 100% lit when it comes to like skull teeth. But overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys get inspiration. If you guys don't know what you want to be for Halloween, you can do this. But all in all, I'm digging the purples. Like this video, subscribe to my channel. If you guys haven't already subscribed, please, 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 guys. I'm trying to expand my channel. Let me know in the comments down below what video I get. I let me know in the comments down below what video ideas you guys want to see me do. I'm just gonna end it right here. So don't forget to subscribe, y'all. Bye, y'all. <laughs>